Alright guys, welcome back to a brand new episode of Ark on the Gaming Evolve Vanilla with Sprinkle Server. Today, we are going to be making another OP weapon. Now, previously we made this guy right here, the Ascendant Assault Rifle. I had this blueprint and we made this guy up and you guys really loved that episode. And uh, there was there was outcry for, a, uh, for another one featuring, oh wait, wrong one, featuring the Ascendant Shotgun blueprint that we have. People said, hey, you should do this and I was like, yeah, sure. I will. So we're going to be doing that today. <laughs> so we're going to be building this. It's pretty freaking expensive. Um, so it costs basically just under a thousand metal, 1700 polymer. That's really, really expensive. Uh, and then 1400 CP, which is, it's not too bad. I mean, I already have that. I have my snail farm and that really gets me a lot of CP. So we're pretty good on the CP, but the polymer is going to take a while because uh, we have to collect up all of that freaking obsidian. Um, I think we have some here, but not enough, I don't think. So yeah, we're gonna have to build this guy up today. It's gonna be really amazing. Um, I can't wait to have it. But one thing I want to show off is <laughs> this blueprint right here. This used to be a Mastercraft rocket launcher blueprint, but then in the recent update in Arc, they uh, they completely nerfed rocket launchers. You cannot get a better quality than just this. It doesn't even have a quality, as you can see. <laughs> you, it's just a rocket launcher now. I don't like that. <laughs> even I go okay, okay. Even the fact that, like, okay, the rocket launchers may be OP if you get really good ones. Fair enough. I don't mind if they do just a certain amount of damage, but you can't even get better durability on it. It's insanely silly. It's really good for PvP, because a lot of people are probably happy about this, although a lot of people are probably annoyed about it. I'm kind of annoyed because I was going to use the Mastercraft one that we found on the bosses, and now I can't. So that really sucks. It's kind of rocket launchers are going to be useless now for me. Because we have better weapons than that. I mean, the assault rifle is probably going to be the best for taking down the bosses. So, we're definitely going to use one of these. Uh, well, this one right here, basically. So, let's get right into this then. Um, we have to build this guy up today. So, we have a lot of stuff to collect. Also, remember this? <laughs> you guys gave me a lot of good names, okay? Um, I was like, I was thinking of calling it Cobalt. Because I was like, oh, it's a really cool word. Like, it's a, it could be a cool name for it. And then, you know, you guys gave me lots of really good suggestions, and uh, one of them that stood out, and it makes so much sense, I'm such an idiot. Uh, I don't even know why I didn't even think of this. Mystique! <laughs> it's a mutant, it's a freaking randomly mutated Thyla, so Mystique is a perfect name for it. Oh my god, it's like, it's just the best name. Thank you guys. A lot of people said it, but thank you everybody who said it. And thank you for all the other suggestions, there was a lot of really good ones, like... I saw Stitch, which is like, which is a great name, like as a Stitch from Lilo and Stitch, because he's kind of like the same color. And then um, it was a bunch of other amazing names, but uh, I, yeah, I chose Mystique because it just it just suits it the best. So uh, yeah, that's that's what we're gonna be calling it. Anyway, we gotta go on our merry way. Let me see how much obsidian we have, because I think we have like 800 or so polymer itself, and I know that we have some organic polymer. Uh, let's just use this thing here. Oh, we don't have very much. Okay, yeah, we're gonna have to head up to the mountain today. So I'm gonna bring the blueprint with me. I probably don't need this gun, so I'll chuck this back. Let me see. Also, by the way, if at any point in this video you find yourself liking this video, be sure to beat the crap out of that like button. It really helps me out. <laughs> okay. Um, I could probably drop off some other stuff here, but then I think we're gonna head on our merry way. So I guess I'll meet you guys up at the top of the volcano at the forge. Okay guys, so we're up at the volcano, and I've been up here for a little while so far. What we're doing is we're just collecting up the metal and chucking that into here. Oh man. I've got a lot, and actually, I remember this thing was pretty full before I even got here. Uh, last time I was over here, I filled this thing up quite a bit. I don't think very many people have been using this too much because it's still really full. So uh, we might take some more of this home today, but I've definitely put in a fair share today. And uh, we have a bit of obsidian here too, let's just chuck that in. This right here that I'm using in case anybody doesn't know, we have S plus on here which is kind of like a vanilla fixing mod and it has this thing called a pole gun so you can kind of just move resources. It, it's kind of handy for PvE, like I don't know how OP that would be for PvP but it's nice for PvE. It, uh, it kind of just makes things a little bit easier and makes things a little bit quicker as well. <laughs> so we have quite a lot of polymer crafting up here so far. I brought over a bunch of my Akatina paste, and we have, what is that, 360 so far? Nice, okay, so I gotta keep collecting some obsidian. I actually have some in my inventory as well, apparently. 
Uh, let's chuck this in here. Nice. Okay. So we're just basically working on this, uh, just running around on the on the dodic, doing all this for a while. Um, I think there's a couple more obsidian nodes over this way, but I think I've pretty much taken out all the ones at the back over there. We actually have a couple levels here. Nice. How many was that? Like three levels? Holy crap! This thing's freaking OP. <laughs> this is an imprinted dodic, so uh, its its weight is very very high from the imprint. Which is awesome. Uh, so there's a couple of obsidian nodes over here. And um, we're just going to break the metal. I know we don't get metal from them. But we get levels from uh, just harvesting. So it's best to just keep breaking everything. Plus I can reveal more obsidian like this one. <laughs> and then there's also some over here. I think there's a node. Yeah, there's a node right behind that thing right there. Awesome. Okay. Eh, the stone really weighs you down. But uh, it's definitely worth it for the XP. Let's just get rid of that. So drop all. Nice. Okay. Awesome. So yeah, I'm pretty much just working on this. I think there's another obsidian node right there. Um, this is probably gonna take a little while though, because like I'm mostly gonna wait for the crafting of the uh, of the polymer. Like that's gonna take a, a huge amount of time <laughs> because I don't know, like freaking fabricators are really really slow. I can't wait till I get a replicator so I can actually just make the polymer like extremely quick. Although you know, obviously it's gonna cost some uh, some element for that, but it's probably gonna be worth it just for the speed at which you can actually craft stuff because it, I think it crafts like four times quicker or something like that. Uh, let's just get rid of all this stupid stone. Drop all. Nice. Um, oh, there's another obsidian node right here. Nice. Is there, I think there might be one if I break this rock. Oh, is this also a rock? Oh, it is. <laughs> I keep like, I don't know, it's hard to tell between pieces of rocks that I've just broken and actual rocks. Because like that right there looked like one of those rocks right there. I don't know. Oh, look, there's some more right there. Awesome. Yeah, I keep forgetting, like, I don't know all the locations up here. Um, on the other mountain, which is Polymer Mountain, which is the one I like to call Polymer Mountain anyway. I lived over there in Season 2. Um, it's that mountain around, what is that, like 35, 60-ish? It's that one right there, basically to the right of the volcano. I used to live there in the second season of Gaming Evolved. And uh, I pretty much know where every obsidian node is up there. Because <laughs> I was constantly making polymer. It was great. I even had it like a polymer shop as well. Man, season two was great. It really was. It would have been good if we had like a shopping district this season, but I don't really think it would have worked because like there's not really many resources that are very, very hard to get. Back when we were doing that, like cementing paste was very, very hard to make because you either had to go around on a frog for hours or you had to collect up like a bunch of obsidian as well. Actually, yeah, as well on top of the frog thing. Or else, you know, you had to constantly like get chitin and stone and everything. But uh, I managed to have a pretty good time. Uh, also, beaver dams is a good way of getting it. But yeah, in general, like back then, it wasn't really that easy. You can't just like automatically make it in the background like you can now with the snails. So uh, yeah, the, like basically, cementic paste was our currency on the last server. So, like, everybody bought and sold things for cementing paste. It was great. <laughs> but, uh, unfortunately, I think the only very rare resource right now is element. And, uh, I don't really think anybody wants to give any of that stuff away. I don't even think anybody, anybody on here even has that. I don't think a boss has actually been spawned on here yet. Or summoned, not spawned. Um, so, I think that's probably all the obsidian nodes. I don't, I think there's some back here if I break these guys. Oh, yeah, there's one right there. Nice. <laughs> So they're kind of all like hidden around here. It's it's a little bit awkward because you got to break every single rock and every single metal node to actually get to them. But uh, it's okay. So yeah, I think I'll probably just work on this for for like a little while longer. We have quite a lot of it right here. Let's just drop all that stone. How much do we have? Let me see. Yeah, we've probably got around a thousand obsidian there, I'd say, and then probably in around the same amount of metal. So it's probably high times to head back to the uh, forge and drop off the stuff, but I pretty much just scraped this whole area clean. Um, why does this still sound like I'm rolling? That was weird. Oh, is that another node over there? Oh, it is. It must have respawned. I didn't see this one. <laughs> Alright, so yeah, I think we're going to work at this for a while, guys, and then we'll be back. Okay guys, so we're back at base right now, and we have a lot of stuff to unload here. So first of all, I actually need to go ahead and grab all of my gunpowder. I made up a bunch of gunpowder earlier. Uh, it's all inside of that chemistry bench. Wait, where am I going? It's gunpowder's up here. <laughs> okay, so we got, oh my god, we got a lot of gunpowder. Let's grab all that, nice. Um, and then we also need to grab some metal too. 
So let's grab it from the Quetzal. I brought back 2200 metal because we had smelted up a huge amount. We could have taken more if we wanted to. I just couldn't carry it because I have a lot of obsidian too. Uh, where? Oh no, that's normal metal. Okay, that makes sense now. I was getting a little bit worried there. I was like, what the hell? So this one here is on the Quetzal. Actually, I should name that one. <laughs> uh, let's just grab it all, I guess. Sure. Can't hurt. And uh, we might as well just chuck our obsidian back into here. So I brought back like, I think it was like 1700 or something obsidian. I actually over collected by a huge amount. So where is the obsidian? Uh, this one right here, 1800. Nice, okay. So that is a huge amount of obsidian, holy crap. Why is there obsidian in the silica pearls one? What? What? That doesn't make any sense. Why is there obsidian in here? What? Oh, it looks like I accidentally put some obsidian into there. Okay, well, we could just grab that. Apparently, we had a lot of obsidian then. I don't even know. What? How the hell did that happen? How did we put it into there? How much? Oh my god, we've got a lot of obsidian. Let me see. Holy crap. I, I could have... I, I nearly... Oh, I wouldn't even have to have went to the volcano. <laughs> I, like, if I had known... Well, I mean, yeah, we brought back a huge amount. Probably still would have had to, but still. Like... I could have made up some... Oh, I didn't even know we had that. It was in the wrong... <laughs> I accidentally put it into the wrong crafting bench. Oh, well, that's just great. Well, you know what? Let's go ahead and get some of these things crafted. So first of all, we need to start working on some shotgun shells in the background here. So we got to get some simple bullets. Let's just... Let's just craft, like... How much are they? Hmm. You know what? Let's just craft as many as we can. Yeah, we get, like, 900 or so. That's good, I guess. Um, <laughs> and then we need these guys. Are, oh, no, no, no. We don't want to make up that many because we need some gunpowder for the shotgun shells as well, apparently. Great. Well, that's just silly. How many can we make up so far? 12. Okay, great. Let's make up... Um, hmm, it costs three. Let's make up uh, 600. Okay. 600 of these. And we should have a lot of gunpowder left over after. And that should be enough for a couple of these. Okay, cool. So now we gotta work on actually making this thing. So let's chuck this guy in here. Uh, we gotta turn this on. So I have some gas inside of here. We still have a lot of this oil. I gotta actually get some spark powder and light that thing up. So I can actually turn that into oil. Or into gasoline even. Uh, so where's my blueprint? Down the end. So what do we need? We need to grab... Um, first of all, I think we should grab the... Cementing paste. Oh, I thought that was the pull button. There it is. Okay, so cementing paste. Um, right here, actually. Let's go for the Akatina paste. So we need around 1,400. Okay, these guys all have a good amount on them. Uh, that's 400. So I need 1,000 from here then. Okay, pull all of that. Nice. That should be enough, I think, because there was a little bit left in here. That might be enough. I'm not sure. Let's have a look. Uh, yeah, we're good for cementing paste now. So I need to pull the polymer. So let's pull the organic polymer that we have, because we should have some inside of the snail, and then I bet my moss chops has a bunch as well from the baby penguins that he's been eating, so that looks like a good amount anyway. So we have like, uh, what is that, 4,500? Or not 4,500. Yeah, <laughs> never mind. Uh, okay, so what else do we need now? Uh, we need a good amount of polymer anyway. Okay, so we need, what is that? Okay, so we need around 1,200, and then we can pull some out and just completely use the organic polymer that we have. So, normal polymer. Uh, that is from the Quetzal. Let's grab 1,200 of that. Nice. Man, this pulling system here, like, this is really good. It, it seriously saves a lot of time. Just running back and forth, just, like, nonsense like that. It's just, oh, it's so handy. Okay, so how much can we take out here? We could take out... Um... Let me just take out 50, and I could just add in some more till that thing goes blue. So we need to add in 21, I think. 21. Here we go, guys. Craft. Oh, man. This thing is expensive. <laughs> oh, well, that was a lot of resources, anyway. <laughs> Somebody was saying in the last time that we crafted, like, a really OP weapon, they were saying it would be funny if the fabricator turned off halfway through so I'd lose everything. And that is just not okay. You cannot, you cannot say that to me. You'll just, uh, I would have probably died. <laughs> okay, so how much is this crafted up then? We've got a good amount so far. Um, 
let me just cancel that for now and we'll just craft up some shotgun shells just to get them going uh, so we can make 128 okay uh, we should probably definitely make some more normal bullets uh, wow what are we gonna be out of definitely the bullets yeah okay so we need to make up some more bullets then um, let's make 300 and let me grab that out actually and chuck that back in over here uh, weapons drop these guys in okay let me see let me go grab some wait you know what first of all we gotta paint it I'm getting a little bit framey around here right now and it's kind of annoying <laughs> sorry if that's annoying you too uh, you know what I was gonna search for the paints but we're just gonna scroll down and grab them um okay so let's grab some cyan and some navy I might I'm gonna need to make up some more paint at some point because I'm running out of like certain colors like navy I I don't have a whole lot of it left <laughs> I keep using it all right let me see oh man I never really owned a shotgun I never really used them too much um is that gonna look good or would that look good as cyan Hmm. Not sure. I think I want to do the top barrel cyan, maybe. Oh no, that would look good as a navy. What's this? What region is this? Oh, it's like right on the back there. Oh, that looks, uh... Hmm, maybe if we do that, mm, that doesn't really stick out though. What region was the this one here? Maybe we will do... That navy... This one here, cyan. That cyan as well. Looks good so far. What else do we need to paint? Uh, what was that? We have that one painted navy so far. What is this one here? That's like these things right here. We'll paint that cyan. And we'll paint that cyan as well, actually. That looks pretty good. I like it. All right, let me see. Holy crap. <laughs> Oh man, that looks amazing. You know what, I think uh, we might go back and those little bits on the front, I might paint that navy instead. Just to give it a bit of variation. That's this one here. Uh, yeah, navy. Here we go, let me see. Yeah, that looks a little bit better now. Nice, okay. I'm liking this, guys. It looks really good. Okay, <laughs> let's run over here and just grab up some of these bullets here. Or their shotgun shells, even. Oh, it looks like they all crafted up. Okay, well, let's just grab them all then, I guess. Um, okay, cool. And I guess I can turn off the fabricator. Just need to be on. All right. Uh, I got to go out and test this thing. Um, let's grab our... We'll grab our thylal once I just stuck back some of this stuff here. Uh, stick back this polymer that goes in here. Nice. Okay. Um, do we want a scope on it, too? That could look kind of cool. Let me have a look with the scope. Uh, no, wrong one. It's in here. Assault rifle. Um, it's this button to take away the scope, right? No, it's this one. There we go. Let's just... Ugh, I gotta just reload this now. Put those bullets back in. Okay, nice. Okay, let me see. Uh, put the scope onto this guy. And I will put you back in there. Okay. It looks good with the scope, actually. I kind of like it. Let me see. Eh, it looks okay. I mean, I, what the hell? Is that like a crack on the top? Can you guys see that just at the start of the barrel there? What the hell is that? It's like a little smudge or something. We've already ruined the gun. <laughs> wow, okay. Let's take out our thyla here. Why, why are we so slow? Oh, that was weird. Okay. Let's uh let's head down here and see what's what's what down here. Okay, what do we got? We got a piranha, no thank you. Gonna go for something bigger. Are we doing that weird like flying thing on Thala? Yeah, I think it's when you come out of the water, you just like magically are like flying instead of running. <laughs> Which just looks hilarious, like let me see. Da 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 <laughs> Oh no! <laughs> I hate freaking Therizinosaurus. Let's just get away from it. Uh, let's go fight like a trike or something. There's more Therese over there. Um, a trike or anything. There's a Parasaur right here. 
We can fight you. Oh, whoa. <laughs> That's a lot of damage, guys. Just one shot at level 12. It's pretty good. Uh, let me see how many shots on Bronto. Actually, no, let's try it on these packies here. Whoa, okay. One shot at level 24. Uh, I hit them in the head. I know they take less damage with the head. Okay, well, three shots on level 30, but they were all headshots, so they take less damage. Um, let's try it out on something else here. I'm a little bit hungry. Bam! <laughs> no, I can't get that one. Damn. All right, wait. Anything else? There's a turtle, but they're kind of tanky. Let's try it out on these uh, shallies over here. I don't think that first shot actually hit, did it? Oh no, they're hurting me. Ah. Oh god, no. Am I gonna pass out? I think I'll be fine, but... Ugh. Come on, die. It's dead. I got poop on my face. Why? <laughs> it's not nice. Why would they throw poop at me? Alright, let me see. Anything else to kill? There's a theory, but I don't really like messing with those things. Um, we could probably fight that trike there. Let me just get some reloading done here. And we gotta see how much damage this thing actually took after just a couple uses. I was actually gonna go on the ground, but I'm a little bit nervous about this theory. Yep, it's gonna attack. Let's just kill it with the bow, it'll be a little bit quicker. Okay, it's dead. <laughs> you see, they can hurt me when I'm on my mount, so I don't really like that. It's a little bit nerve wracking. Okay, let me see. Level 114 trike. One, oh, we missed that one somehow. Two, three, four. Four shots, but I think trikes also have resistance when you shoot them in the head, so still pretty good. I like it. How the hell did we miss that? We shot like right at him. There's some pigs and stuff over there. Let me get my guy on follow, or my girl, Mystique. <laughs> Let's get Mystique on follow here. Just go savage around here. J <laughs> oh, we're being attacked. There's, uh, Dillos. They're not attacking me, but they're around. Oh, what's that? Oh, oh that almost got me. Mystique is just running through and killing anything. <laughs> oh my god. Alright, over here. Nice! Oh my... That is insane! This thing does so much damage! Oh, I would love to get a proper damage counter, but I don't want to turn that server setting on, because I know a lot of people wouldn't like that. Yeah, you just kill all those compies. It's perfect. She's so majestic. I love that Thyla. It's actually the best color ever. I don't think I could have gotten a better mutation. And actually, somebody somebody commented and said, why do you always get blue mutations? I have no idea. We've gotten, actually, we've gotten quite a few blue mutations. We've got the, uh, the Baryonyx, and then I guess, you know what? The Saber wasn't our original mutation, but it was somebody else's, but we still have it, so. I mean, that's like three randomly mutated dinos that are blue that we own so that's pretty good and we have the the rg as well and we have oh the sheep as well actually holy crap we have a lot we have like blue sheep i don't know if you guys all saw that um i just i didn't do an episode on it i just did like a little i showed them off at one point but uh yeah <laughs> we have blue sheep that's amazing all right let's uh let's fight this turtle let's get a uh, mystique to finish it off there nice oh I thought I heard a Dillo. No, okay. Let's go over here then. Oh, there's plenty of little victims over here. Should probably kill this guy right here though. Yeah, it's, oh, is it coming for us? What's it doing? Now it's coming for us. And it's dead. Nice, okay. Uh, there's bugs, that's not fun. All right, well, there's some trikes down here we could fight. Uh, we're a little bit thirsty. Oh, yeah, bugs. <laughs> I think I might have shot Mystique a little bit there. Kill the bugs. Nice. You do that. I'll be over here. Oh, there's another theory. Damn it. Okay, come on. Missed that one. Oh, no, Mystique, don't get in the way. Oh, attack, kill it. Okay, it's dead. <laughs> Bam. Whoa! I know that thing was a little bit damaged, but that was a 120 and we like one-shot it. 
It was a little bit damaged though, but still. I do like the way that the the hollow scope thing actually looks on it, but I don't like I don't know, this is it's not It looks really good in first person, not so good in third person. And uh the scope looking down it, it's kind of a little it's it's very pointless. <laughs> it really is. I don't know. Let me see, let's fight a stego. Oh, we got a uh we don't need any of those, we got plenty of those. Okay, that didn't work somehow. Now it's happened. Okay, anything else? A couple more dillos over there. Let's kill the stego. Bam! And bam! Two shots! I didn't even get the second shot. Mystique killed it. Okay, but it would have been two shots. Pretty good. Okay, there's another stego over here we can test this on. Okay. Headshot! Oh my god! <laughs> One shot at level 24 with a headshot. Amazing. Okay. Anything else? What's, what's attacking? Oh, it's a raptor. Kill it. Okay, you got it. Alright, what else is around here? Anything decent? Come here, Mystique. What are you doing? Um, let me see. Can I climb up this cliff here? I think I could. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Oh, a trike egg. I will take that. Oh, it's a turtle egg. Level 24 one shot. Oh, there's a bug there I tried to hit. Oh no, it's gonna push me off the cliff. <laughs> yes, thank you, Mystique. <laughs> oh, okay. Ooh, get it. Get the bugs, they're on me. Get the bugs, Mystique, get them. <laughs> Alright, come here, come here, come here, come here. No, no, no. 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 The, the turtles are gonna be after me. Quick, help. Save me. Ah! No. <laughs> turtles are after me because I took their baby. Oh, we got it. Okay. Misty, how are you doing? Yeah, you're still doing really good. You haven't really lost very much health there. Um, That is amazing. Huh, I just noticed the video is a little bit framey. A little bit, actually. I don't know why, but OBS seems to have dropped in frame rate, so... I think we're gonna take a quick cut here. I'm gonna have a little... See if I could fix that. So we'll be back. Okay, so we are back, and... Uh one shot. <laughs> Alright, I've actually just noticed that OBS is still a little bit framey, so I don't know what the issue is. I might need to do an update or something, so I'll figure that out at some point, but uh, yeah, let's just kill a couple more things here before we end this off. Um, let's kill some of these parasers. I'll probably end up doing like a cave or something with this at some point, um, because I think it's pretty good. I think it would do good against like a group of spiders and stuff like that, you know. Um, so yeah, I really like it. I, I, yeah, it's great. I love, uh, I love getting really OP weapons like this. Tis awesome. Alright, let's kill this strike. One shot. Oh man, that is just great. Let's just kill this dodo as well. Alright, you need to come with me. Are you coming? Alright, I can see, is that a Diplo in there? Yeah, let's kill the Diplo. Alright, let me see. One, two, three, four. Four shots for a level 24. That is not bad at all. Where is Mystique? Oh, what are you doing over there? Yeah, what are you doing over there, buddy? Come on. Come on. What are you doing? It's like stuck? You're not followed to me, so you're stuck. I'm trying to get something. I don't know what the hell you're doing. Come on, over here. I could have died without you. <laughs> Alright. Let's kill this trike here. One shot. <laughs> oh, that is like so overpowered. Like, one shotting trikes, just amazing. You can just see we've been through this whole area, just stuff dead everywhere. <laughs> one shot and then, like, eaten immediately. Oh, uh, that Paris' family are not gonna be happy when they can ever. They're never gonna find that guy again. <laughs> are you coming? What the hell? It's like. I don't even understand. It keeps like looking at the floor or something. Oh my god. So amazing. This is just too much fun, just running around one-shotting things. Bam. Uh Alright, I think there's some more bugs. Yeah. Come on, Mystique, kill the bugs. Nice. Okay, awesome. Uh yeah, I guess we'll hop on here. Maybe have a ride around down here. Uh I can see some shallies here. Don't really want to mess with those on foot just in case they knock me out. So let's just kill them. Keep forgetting that these things spawn around here. I don't see enough of them. 
I mean, we've seen quite a few today, but still, I don't often see them. Bam. Okay. Mystique helped out with that one, but, you know, that would have been like three shots, maybe. Right. No scope. Amazing. <laughs> uh, this is great. I'm loving this. I really do. I love getting these weapons. It's like, it's so much fun just running around, testing it out, and like, I never really use shotguns in Ark, but I would definitely use this thing. It is very, very powerful. But I do love my assault rifle. It's probably still my, my favorite out of uh, the few that we've made. Obviously, my, you know, my ascended bow is a must. I will never go anywhere without this thing. It's like, I don't know. I love using the bow in Ark. It really, it's, it's great. But uh, when it comes to other weapons, there's the snipers, there's a shotgun, and then there's the assault rifle. The assault rifle is probably my second favorite. Um, and then, obviously, I'd probably say shotgun, and then the the sniper. Probably last with the sniper. I mean, the sniper is really fun and all, but yeah, it doesn't do enough damage. <laughs> Even though I have an ascended one, it still doesn't do enough damage. Um, but yeah, it's pretty fun anyway. Alright, so, you know what guys, that's probably going to be it for today. We've been just running around, killing everything, having a lot of fun. We made this thing, it took absolutely ages to make. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and if you did, be sure to beat the crap out of that like button. We're getting blinded here, because I can't hit the stillo. And, uh, <laughs> if you guys want to see more, you know what to do, you can subscribe. We've got a lot of awesome videos coming up this week, um, so hopefully you will enjoy some of those. And, uh, I have some other news coming eventually here, but, uh, we'll, we'll wait for that. So, anyway, I will see you guys next time.